Wow, those taste really bad. Hi, Shani Fannies. Welcome to Educating Shani. I'm Shani and I'm recovering from eating disorder. Hi, Shani. Hi. Oh, those things are so gross. So what I just took is steroids. I went to the doctor yesterday to talk about my pain, how it's getting worse. And so she wanted to try putting me on some steroids. And obviously I'm a little nervous about that because, well, Ed is a little bit nervous because I hear that steroids make you gain weight. But at this point, and even if I was, even if I did care that much, like I don't care, like I would rather be out of pain. So if I gain weight, then I gain weight. Who cares? I'll be out of pain. <laughs> so it's important to me. That's how bad this is. Like, I just don't care. Um, and I really don't care eat anyway. I just, I don't know, my eating disorder, the past year, if I've had any behaviors, it hasn't been about, you know, preventing weight gain or anything like that. Not that bulimia does necessary, necessarily, but um, anyway, we'll talk about that another day, but I woke up today, it's already dark outside, of course, and uh, I was like, I just need to get out of the house. That's what I need to do. I just need to get out. And so I'm going, even though this is probably a bad idea, it's probably gonna hurt to go out in the cold, but there are times where sometimes I have to choose between my mental health and my physical health, and I figure I'm already in a lot of pain anyway, and my mental health could use a boost, and getting out of the house gives my mental health a boost. So we're gonna get out of the house and do some Christmas shopping and go to a new restaurant that we've been dying to try. It just opened called uh, Happy Teriyaki, I think. If you have one where you live, tell me in the comments below if you like it. But anyway, so let's go out. Okay, this is a bad idea. Okay, bye. You wanna see what it's like living with a prop master? This is why I shouldn't touch things. Let's go get Danny. That's a good 12 inches of steel. What is that length? I mean, 12 inches? 12 inches? With another piece of metal. Nothing. What you making? Where are we going? Uh, just around. These are walls with the chamber logo on them. It'll go together hmm. in a reinforced frame, hmm. and I'll set it all up. And they're made out of uh, um, what kind of poster it board? No, it's a uh, drywall, really thin drywall. That's how thin it is. And I'll score it on the back back here, and somebody will run through it, break away wall. Nice. So, we messed up your present in your office. Oh, are you kidding me? Mm -mm. What did you do? I dropped the bow. Oh, okay. I took the lid off and oh. the bow's lid off. Yeah, no, that's fine. Sorry. Sorry. No, no, here. What is this for? This is all for Monday. What's it for? Uh, Chamber's doing a big, like, promotional. Uh, uh, commercial for themselves, just to kind of self-promote themselves. And they're gonna go in all out, so the volcano is for them. And the big present someone's gonna pop out of this is for them. The walls are for them. I've uh, got some special effects fog and air blowers and stuff for them. You did a really good job. I mean, it was it's kind of a hack job, but you can't tell unless you look inside. That's what it really looks like. That's fine. That's cool, honey. Now ask me how I'm going to get out the door because it's too big. How are you going to get it out the door because it's too big? Well, Shannon, let me show you because okay. I'm a genius. Okay. I made it so that it can go flat. Ah. And, get out the way and fit out the door and in the truck. Ah. Smart, huh? You are smart. SMRT. SMRT. This is why you're the most requested pop designer in Utah. Chamber Media, by the way, is the place that I took you guys to a week or two ago. Is that what it was for mm -hmm. that musical that they were doing? 
That was their studio. That was Chamber Media's studio. Danny works for them a lot. He does a lot of commercials and <coughs> just whatever. And they love him over there and he loves them. So that's what he's building all this stuff for is for their promotional stuff. Okay, guys, it's time for my outfit of the day. I wear this every single day and it's very loose very baggy. I'm gonna take you with me to distract myself because I'm freaking freezing and I have to run out there and oh, ow. Oh. family just like does gift cards and just they're the type of family where don't they don't care I just mean, go buy what you want to buy it's smart make yourself happy we don't have to worry about like it's just so much easier we make christmas easy yeah but then there's no surprise you know what i'm saying like sometimes it's fun to surprise and you can't like wrap a gift card. Wrapping a gift is the best part, making it look all pretty and special. No, it's yeah, absolutely huh. not. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. You literally are making trash. You're killing the planet by wrapping gifts because you tear it off and you throw it away. Bags and bags of it. I'm sorry. Who is it that Christmas morning gets so excited? I'm not saying it's that not Santa exciting. Santa brings all these gifts for I'm you. I'm not saying it's not and exciting. And that you sit I'm on the floor saying. like a little five-year-old boy so excited to open Santa's gifts. And so, just, oh my gosh, there's so many presents. I'm and we have saying. so many to I'm unwrap. I'm so excited to unwrap all the presents. I'd be just excited if you didn't have wrapped presents. No, you wouldn't. If I just laid your gifts out and didn't wrap them. Great, I can get right into playing. Okay. We just won't wrap yours this year. You can wrap mine. Okay. And I won't wrap yours. Okay. Okay. Let's see how far you get with that. I think my throat is closing. What did you take? Steroids? Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> These steroids, I don't know. I'm nervous now because I was just telling Danny, like, I'm swelling. Don't, you're not <gasps> you're not swelling. Yes, no, I am. You're it's a d it's a d sweller you can't get, i know it is but 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 hey we're taking it because my you're, dream we're taking it because you were swelling and i you just get, told you, you last are night totally in your head about that so just relax you're okay i just told you that last night i see. had a dream let me see that i had a bad reaction let me see you're not swelling though you're great yes i am and you know it i know your face no you're not and granted be be aware we're taking this because you've been getting swollen lately about what's that so so yeah, you're probably swollen from your normal stuff. We're getting a shake because I don't think I ate enough with these pills. So I'm gonna coat my stomach a little more. I'm telling you, I'm gonna die. I can feel it. I had a dream. I had a dream that I had a horrible reaction. Listen to my voice. You can tell my throat is closing. I'm telling you, my throat is closing. I'm gonna die. Danny, hmm? I'm gonna die. If I die, then what are you gonna do? Can you get me a rainbow casket? Sure. With like kittens and unicorns on it? Do they have to be alive? We're at Hobby Lobby, of course, and we're gonna pick out our ornament for the year. We always get a new ornament for our tree and we're Hopefully gonna decorate our tree tonight or tomorrow.
the avocado. What'd you find? I found a gold bar. Yeah, he really wanted the butter. We should have grabbed it that day. home and we're gonna do advent finally right okay so this is what we got we got matching ones and these have those little like metal puzzles inside so we're going to race every day and whoever finishes first is the winner but we have to catch up so we're gonna do four of them so find number one my steroids are kicking in i all of a sudden have a bunch of energy so i think i might win otherwise daddy would win okay I hope they are. Let's see. Yeah, yeah. triangles. They're the same. Ready. This is what it looks like on your... Don't look at it. Sorry. On your mark. Get set. Go. Can you not bend it? Mm -hmm. What the... Well, can you bend it? Or is that cheating? I win. How did you do it? Wait, now you have to see me how. So it's gapped, oh, it's gapped a little bit right there and right there already. They're oh, pretty so you tough. Put the gaps together? So they're pretty tough. You can't really bend it. But if you aim those guys up like that. Oh my gosh. And then slide them apart. I knew he would beat me. Good job. Thanks. Okay, number two. So it looks like, what are you supposed to do? Separate all of them? Uh, I don't know. Ready, set, go. You're supposed to actually get that one off, but you do see the same trick, you just pop it through that gap and then they release. What do you do? I don't know. We're tearing them all apart. It doesn't come with instructions. So. I noticed that, which is a little weird. Like, okay. just number three. Do what you want. <laughs> <We're> <laughs> tired. Moving on. Number three. Don't look at it first this time. Ready? Come on. Hold on. Don't look at it. You're looking. I'm not. I'm looking at you. You're already you. planning. Don't look. You're. I have you on camera. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I, wait, I can't. Oh, I win. Hey, what? That, <laughs> That was nothing. You didn't. You dropped it. <laughs> I won by default. <laughs> I wonder if I can put it back together. You don't know how you got it apart. How are you going to do that? Maybe if I just drop mine too, then it'll work like yours did. Okay. How'd you do that? Wow, baby. I actually won. You that, counts, one. Right? that counts, right? That counts. You can get it back on. Yay. 
before I get mine off, then two to one. We need to be keeping score. Where's the marker? I'll write it on here. Any, write it on the thing. Any, of course, this mother is <laughs> I got it up part, by the way. You got it? Yes, I just tore it apart. <laughs> I'm not sure that's how I was doing it, but right. I did it. Ready? Okay. The fourth, the final one for today. It's actually pretty easy when you think about it. I'm not capable of thinking about it. <laughs> you can do it. I can't think backwards to get it back together though. <laughs> Come on, let me see yours. Oh, 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 hey! We did it! We did it! Good job. Good job. Okay, three to one is the score, score so far. This is kind of fun. Yeah. A little challenging. Yeah. little... It's fun. Little... You're gonna win. Overall, for sure. You know, I don't know. Okay, now we're gonna do my favorite toy one. Except Danny's here so you get to do it. I'm saving the boxes. So yeah, you totally. You should. It's a fun little box. So. I can make my own outfit. Cute little basketball. Cute. Little stress ball. That's perfect oh, oh. for you. I don't stress. Is this better? Is that better for you? <laughs> Okay, this is a really weird angle, but let's do the Christmas card giveaway. So the winner of this card from the other day is, drum roll, Endanger Dreamer, you win this card. So please message me your address on uh, Instagram at educating Shani, wait, at educating underscore Shani, and you are the winner of this and $20. I don't have the $20 right here, but I promise there will be $20 in it. So congratulations for winning, yay! It's so hard to choose. Can I just tell you, I wanna pick all of you. I wish I had like millions of dollars that I could just give every single one of you $20, and I wish I had like millions of dollars worth of energy that I could make enough cards for all of you, but I just don't, so I'm sorry. Today's Christmas card giveaway is going to be this, and this is a very special card. And I'm gonna tell you why it's special later, maybe. Um, this is a special card. Should I tell you now? I, here's the thing. So one of you might pick it, and then I pick you to win it, but then once you find out what's special about it, you might not want it anymore. So I'm trying to decide if I should tell you now. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you now. Okay, so this card is very special because one night, <laughs> um, I was uh, moving some cards around, looking at my cards, and um, I noticed there was a little spider on this card right there, right there, just a little spider. So I smashed the spider onto the card and then I wiped it off. So it's clean, there's no spider on it, but I'm just saying I did kill a spider right there. So if you would like a card that has old spider guts on it that have been wiped off, but I'm sure microscopically they're still in there somewhere, then you get to win this card. So whoever wants the spider gut card, tell me in the comments below. And there'll be $20 in it at least, so that's good. You're welcome. Okay, this is gonna be vertical because I'm. Oh, sorry, I didn't turn this off. I'm watching um, Colleen's old cancer. Uh, um, oh my gosh, my. Hold on, my head is killing me. Cancer fundraiser, thank you. Watching her old ones because her, uh, her cancer fundraiser comes out today actually and you should watch it because so reason number 4,862,000 ,000 that Colleen Ballinger is so wonderful is that every year for her birthday she does a live stream for 
childhood cancer, which is so sweet. She raises so much money. She's raised dozens of thousands of dollars, maybe even hundreds of thousands. I'm not sure at this point, but I'm going back and watching her old ones because today she's gonna post her new one. So you should go watch a live stream at, I think she said 12 o'clock her time, California Pacific Standard. You should go and watch, and even if you can't donate, um, just you watching will help because she can donate. I know she donates everything from the AdSense that the video gets as well, like the live stream. So, and she's giving away a bunch of cool prizes if you donate or if you share it. If you can't donate, you can also just share it, which is what I'm doing. I am also donating. Um, and it's really awesome that she does that. I'm really, really proud of her for that. So anyway, that's what I'm watching right now. I'm watching the old ones while I'm working on these cards for everyone. Um, but I have the biggest headache I think I've ever had in my life and it is killing me, but like I'm trying to, trying to get through, uh, these cards and writing and, and, and making envelopes for them as fast as I can. Cause there's so many for you guys that I've given away, but also, but mostly for like other friends and family. So Oh, excuse me, I can't stop burping. But anyway, um, yeah, probably like two hours ago. It's like 3.30 in the morning for me. Probably just a couple hours ago. Um, well, first of all, when we got home tonight, I had so much energy all of a sudden. And like, I felt good. I wasn't hurting at all. Um, I mean, I was hurting a little, but not nothing compared to my usual pains. Um, and then... Um, and then about an, I don't know, maybe two hours ago or so, I got hit with the worst headache slash body aches that I've had in a very long time. Like it feels like if you touch any inch of my body, I will punch you in the face. That's how bad it hurts. Like it's really bad. So I don't know what's going on there. And I'm afraid that I am having a weird reaction to the steroids, um, but maybe that's normal at first. I don't know, but... I'm seriously, I've never been in so much pain in my life. <laughs> I mean, I've been in worse pain than this, but like, it feels, this is one, some of the worst pain that I've ever felt. Like every, I can feel every bone of in my body is just on fire in my head and I don't get headaches often at all. And I am just, my head is pounding and I don't know. So anyway, so I'm going to go to bed. But if you want a card for me and you haven't sent me your address, can you please do so? In fact, if you've won a card for me ever, especially on my birthday, I gave some cards away on my birthday, but ever, if you've ever won a card for me, please resend me your address because my messages in Instagram will only let me scroll back so far. And I'm afraid that I've misplaced a couple addresses and there's a few few that I have just been frantically going through my account looking for and I can't find it anywhere. So if you want a card for me um, and you haven't received it yet, please send me your address again on Instagram at educating underscore Shani, please. That would really help me out. I'm trying to get organized now so that I can be sure the ones that I've done and the ones that I haven't done, like D's Danmar, uh, I think I gave for the bir my birthday. Still haven't gotten yours. Eric Tiger, I haven't gotten yours. Um, Dana, who just won the other day, I haven't gotten yours that I can find anyway. Amanda, that won the other day. Um, so even if you did send it to me, will you please resend it? Because I am I I get so many messages and I'm afraid that everything's getting lost. But if you can resend it, I'll be watching very clo closely the next 24 hours and write it down as soon as I get it from you. That would be really, really helpful for me. So anyway i'm gonna i'm gonna edit this and go to bed and hopefully hopefully i'll feel better tomorrow but if any of you have ever had to be on steroids please tell me if this is normal because it's kind of scary to be honest with you i'm not gonna lie to you like i feel awful i feel 10 times worse than i did before but at first it helped a little bit like it really did it helped earlier and i had so much energy and everything and now i feel like i want to die and my face is swollen, my feet are swollen, my hands are, everything is swelling up. Like I know I was joking before that I was swollen, but you can even tell. Look how much more swollen I am from before. I'm telling you, like, oh, especially 
up here my eyes and my head because of this headache it's just swollen like crazy so tell me if that's normal if any of you guys have ever had to be on steroids um it's the six day i forget what it's called hold on it's the six day so like the first day i take six second day i take five four three two one and it's called um it's generic for medrol m-e-d-r-o-l so if any of you have ever taken this please tell me what were your side effects and did it end up working in the end i'm still having faith in it that it will help in the long run so i hope so anyway i need to go to bed i love you guys and i'll see you tomorrow you're beautiful and you're worth it and i am too goodbye